Hey YouTubers! Okay, so I am like extremely bored right now and um, I felt like vlogging because I haven't done a makeup tutorial like in a while. So, um, you know, it's nothing out of this world, but pretty much I'm just gonna like show you guys how I do my makeup and I was just bored so I wanted to film it and um, in case any were wondering, like I always use different style makeups like um, hold on, let me lower the, uh, radio, the TV, actually. Um, okay, what was I gonna say? Okay, yeah, so, um, usually, like, I like, I love to wear red lipstick. Like, I know red lipstick doesn't look good, like, on a lot of people, but I've been told that red lipstick looks great on me, so, like, I wear it a lot. And, um, also because I, like, I am love the retro look, and I'm into, like, all things retro. Hence, my name is Retro. So, um... But I also like to, like, experiment. And sometimes I like to switch around. Like, I like to do, like, the dark eyes, you know, like, dark eyeliner, eyeshadow, and then the, the lips light. Like, I love the 60s retro look, too. So, whatever. Okay, let me start. <laughs> um, okay, usually I use, um, sorry, I moved the uh, camera. Usually I use the uh, Mary Kay medium coverage foundation, but I totally ran out. Like, I'm going to see if I could squeeze, like, a little bit out of it. But just so you guys know, this is the one I use. Ugh, I hate when I can't get it right. I always go to the right and it's actually the left. Okay, there you go. Mary Kay medium coverage foundation. And, yeah, I'm trying to open it. Okay, so I got my little um, sponge thing where I put my, my makeup on. And I'm going to try to squeeze a little bit in there. So that, um, let me see if I could get anything out. Because this is like totally, yeah, pretty much empty. Oh no, a little bit came out. Okay, cool. I thought it had like totally finished, but... I have used like every single drop out of this. Okie dokie. Okay. So, first I'll put my foundation. I have my little mirror here, so if you see me looking to the side, that's what I'm doing. And I have to get it all even first. I love this um foundation. I gotta buy some more because um I bought this one like a while back. Um this lady who used to give me um singing lessons from um she used to go to our church and, and give the the praise and worship team um singing lessons and she used to work for Mary Kay or something like that. So one time she had like one of those little like Mary Kay get togethers, parties, whatever you call it. And um, she was selling cosmetics and stuff and creams and stuff. So I bought I bought this one back then. So it's a little old, but it has lasted me a while. I'm sorry, I'm trying to even it out on my forehead because I still see it's not even there. Um... Yeah, so like I said, it's lasted me a while because I don't use that much. When the lady that was selling it to us uh, was talking to us about the products and everything, um, she showed us that um, we don't really have to like use that much. You know, just a little dab will go a long way. So that's why I don't use a lot of it. So I guess that's why it's lasted me so long. And normally, like, throughout the day, I don't wear, like, a lot of makeup. Like, I don't wear makeup, period, if I'm, like, home. And I just put makeup on, basically, when I'm going to go out. Um, 
like to church or like a party or something like that but normally like just to go to like the grocery store or whatever i don't really put makeup on so i guess that's why the makeup lasts me so long okie dokie okay so now i'm gonna put some eyeshadow and it doesn't have a name it really doesn't like the colors don't have names so i'm gonna show you guys though what brand it is though it's from ulta or ulta i don't know i've never heard of this brand but it's pretty cool my my aunt gave me this back a few christmases ago and i still have it um you can see there it has some kind of like shimmery beige it has like a it has like a white a brownish color and a sort of a lavender type of color I mean it's hard to explain because they don't have names but um but they're still cute so okay and I'm gonna start by applying the lightest one which is the one that looks like white I'm going to put it, cover my entire the entire eyelid. Even it out. Okay. Oh, God. Okay. Sorry, I had something in my eye. Okay, I like to do one eye at a time, so. Now, I'm going to put the one that looks like a shimmery brown on the crease of the eye I blow on it a little bit because sometimes I overdo it so I don't want to look like a clown here either okay, let me try to get closer so you guys can see what I'm doing see I'm just applying that color to the crease just the crease mm -hmm. okay and then I'm gonna get this one it's like a shimmery type of peach yeah like a shimmery peach golden type of color I'll show you is uh, this one there you go I wish they had names it would make it much easier for me <laughs> to explain it to you guys but um oh well okay and then this one going in a little bit I'm gonna do it on the top closer to the brow area I guess it's pretty light, so I don't have to worry about overdoing it. Okay, so I'm going to do the same thing to the other eye. And... So that way, I'm going to do this one faster. Since you guys saw how I did the other one, I don't really have to explain now step by step what I'm doing. Okay. 
Okie dokie. Now the brown one for the crease. <sighs> Last but not least, the top part. You guys, to be honest with you, my eyebrows are crazy. I know. I haven't done them in forever. And honestly, I don't care. <laughs> I'm lazy. And yeah no actually i had been letting them grow out for a little bit because like although i've always loved like really thin eyebrows i go through stages in my life i don't know i'm weird and um i was totally into like the elizabeth taylor stage where i just wanted like the thick eyebrows so i let them grow out for a while so that i could sort of go for that look but um <laughs> but yeah it got a little crazy and out of hand <laughs> okay so now I don't have eyeliner um, I run out so I'm not going to put eyeliner obviously so oh I got to show you guys my cute little makeup bag I am an I love Lucy freak I love all things that have to do with I love Lucy so this is my little makeup bag yeah so um, also I'm going to put the mascara on now hold on I'm trying to get comfortable and don't want the camera to tip over sorry guys hold on one second there we go okay so um yeah mascara now and this the name even fell off and everything because it's a little old yeah i gotta buy new makeup guys because sometimes when i wear old makeup um my eyes start like like hurting i don't know it, it, they sting a little bit you know like when you um when you cook something you fry something in the house and the smoke just gets to your eyes that's how it feels sometimes so yeah a big no-no don't wear old makeup but i never learned my lesson but anyway it's not that old but the thing is that like i said i don't wear makeup very often so it lasts me a while so then since I don't buy new makeup, it's just there and whatever. But yeah, this one, obviously, you could tell, those who could recognize it, this is Maybelline. <laughs> and um, I was really pissed off when I bought it because the one that I always buy is black. Like, I love black. Um, and this one, when I after I bought it, I brought it home and I could have sworn it was black. And I never even knew that blue um, mascara existed. And it was too late and I... You know, I had already opened it, so I wasn't going to return it and exchange it for a black one. So, whatever, I kept it, but I'm not too thrilled about it. But, hey, at least it makes my lashes look longer, so. <laughs> and, okay, hold on. Oh, a tip. When I went to that Mary Kay meeting, they told me, usually, okay, you have your mascara, and usually when you're going to, like, dip it, you know, to get the mascara out, you go like this, right? Well, they taught me that when you go like that, it gets air in it, and it gunks up, it dries up faster. So it says that when you open it, like, instead of just going like that, to, like, twist it, and just twist it all the way up, and then you put it on yeah so that was a cool tip though you know and it's true because when you i guess when you go like that it gets air in it and the mascara dries faster so that's not cool okay and the reason why i blink why i blink while i put it on is because i i've found i've noticed that when i blink i it the mascara turns out like way nicer like my lashes actually get like the full mascara on it so that's the reason why i blink i hardly have any lashes in the bottom 
So I just sort of like just paint it over a little bit because I really don't have much lashes in the bottom. Okay. So the other one. So today I'm go oh why did I close my mirror? <laughs> okay, today I'm gonna go back to the red because all these days that I've been vlogging, I've been using like a really light lipstick, so I haven't worn red in a few days, so I love red. And um this is the one that I that I've been using lately, and it's from Jordana, and it's called Holiday Red. And I don't, I don't have lip liner, but usually I, I used to wear lip liner before I ran out, but, um, I have like really big lips, so I don't really need lip liner, but it's still nice to use it when you want to use like a darker, like outer layer of the lip liner. And then inside you put a lighter color that I always used to love that look, but with red, I guess you don't really need lip liner, especially if you have big lips like me. So yeah. I just love the retro look so I guess that's why I wear a lot of red lipstick okay so that's it you guys that's how I put my makeup on and um, I guess next I'll probably be doing hair or something like that but um yeah I don't have the um when I used to do my pinup style makeup I used to get the um, the eyeliner that I used and do like a little beauty mark on, on my face or something like that. And then I get the cute little retro look going on. But, um, yeah, I ran out of eyeliner too. So, um, I'm not going to do that now. But now you guys see how I do my makeup and voila, there's nothing to it. Okay, guys, so I'll see you in my next video. Um, probably, um here. I'll probably try like a retro style or something. Bye. I hope you enjoyed this video.